All right, so this is a home carbonating system. As you can see, I have this 20-pound uh, tank here. We have this thing called a regulator. It's attached to the tank. And in here is the on-off for the main tank. I always keep that off when I'm not using the tank. And then this here, come down here and look, that's the safety release valve. You open that up and you saw the pressure goes back up here. See that? Focus in on that there. Now we'll turn it back off. And by the way, my tank right now is at 600, well, just over 600 PSI. When I first got it, it was at about 900. It still has like at least several months to go before I have to order gas. Now, this is your standard, here pull back a bit. This is a standard CO2 bottle, or sorry, yeah, pet bottle. Look at the brand there. <laughs> and this is the cap. That's what makes it all happen. So this cap here works with this valve system. You put the cap on, you squeeze out the air, tighten the cap, then take that, pop that on. Now remember, I have both that and that off right now. See how that just put a little bit in? That's whatever was left in the lines. Next we open up this valve, and then just slowly release this. Now focus on the bottle. Now it's pressurized. And if you look there, you can see the bubbles going in. That's the gas. But the trick is you gotta shake it. You gotta shake it for like a good 30 seconds. Because you have to expose um, water, the surface of water, to the gas. The gas won't leach through the entire water, it'll only leach through the surface. So by shaking it, and by the way, focus in on that there. I'm actually wearing it at just past 50 PSI, probably about 54 PSI. But as you can see, when I shake it, it does go down a bit because that's still the gas going in. If you notice that that doesn't go below your preset anymore, then this thing is pretty much saturated. So again, good 30 second shake. Now I turn the safety lever off here. Then I turn this valve off here. There's still pressure in this line and everything else, so I'll give it one last little shake. And then pop that off. And voila, carbonated water. And that's it.